What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, DG, from DG Mindset. If it's your first time, go ahead and hit like, go ahead and hit subscribe, and let's go ahead and jump into this real quick. A lot of people don't realize there's this never fleeting moment. There's this thing that never departs. There's this thing that's always existed and always will exist. Most of us, especially in the Western world, are not aware of what this thing is. It is literally the most important thing there is. It's called the present moment. This is life. That's what life is. Life is your existence in the present moment. And the present moment is all there has ever been. A lot of times I'll tell people there's no such thing as time and they'll look at me crazy. What do you mean there's no such time, thing as time? What are you talking about, DG? Think about it. Is it past or future right now? Uh, neither. Which one is it? Present. Okay. Two hours ago, when your feet were there, two hours ago, was it past, present, or future? Oh, it's the present moment. Okay. It is always eternally the present moment. This was where heaven was. This was where nirvana was. It was in the sliver that we call the present moment. Our job is to live there. But we have this thing that we're wrestling with each and every single waking moment, and it's called the ego. See, the ego doesn't want you to live in the present moment because it can only reside in the past and the future. Our job was to have the awareness so that way the ego would be combated and then we could live in this place called heaven, AKA the present moment. Cool story, D, but how do I find this thing called the present moment? It's really simple. Your physical body, wherever it is, it will always be the present moment. Your job was to bring your mind to where your body was. So we've been gifted with this higher faculty of our mind called the imagination, which was cool because it could go off into the future and create and, and, and get excited, and, but it could also create fear and anxiety and worry and stress. Or we could use this higher faculty of our mind called memory and go back in the past and think about how grateful we are. But it could also create regret and shame and guilt. But when your mind was here in the present moment where your feet were, where your body was, where your breathing was, you would only feel joy, peace, content. This is what everyone talked about when we talked about the fruits of the Spirit. This was our job. How do we become more present? Bring our awareness back to where our feet are. So a lot of times, maybe I'll just sit here and take five conscious breaths. I will feel the air go in through my nose, the coolness of it. And then listen to the sound of when I'm exhaling. Just by doing that, your mind can't go off in the future or the past. It's only in this present moment. It sounds trivial, it sounds simple, that's because it is simple. It's actually so simple, we make it complex. So taking time to be in the moment by breathing. Maybe I'm sitting here rubbing my hands. Maybe I'm noticing the wrinkles on each hand. I'm doing something of bringing my awareness to my physical body or this moment that we call now to eliminate this thing called the future or the past. I can guarantee you this, when you stay present, you will find out more about yourself because that's actually where the true self, your higher self, your spirit, the pure essence of what you are actually resided. When you find it, you will know because you will have a peace beyond understanding. Why do you think we love doing things that bring us joy? Because you can only feel joy when you're actually present. It does not matter if you're sitting on a park bench. It doesn't matter if you're playing with your kids. When you are in the present moment, you will experience nothing but joy, bliss, just pure happiness. Bring yourself here and now. Be where your feet are, my friend, and you will find what you've always been looking for. See, where all we actually wanted was peace, but peace wasn't up there and it wasn't back there. Peace was only found here in the present moment. If this helped you, go ahead and hit like, go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead and hit in the comments how you find the present moment in your own individual life. And until next time, it's your boy DG.